A week ago, in London, Ontario, a 20-year-old man murdered four out of five family members, leaving the fifth member, a nine-year-old boy, an orphan. This act of terrorism shook Canadians to our core. We need to do better than this, because we are better than this. We stand in solidarity with the Muslim community. Good morning, BHS. We are your Bison News Crew. And today is June 14th. And it is a day for. Now let's hop into the now. news. Now for some important information. Exams are almost over. We have one week left. You got this, everyone. Next week is the last week of school. It is almost out for the summer. Attention all grade 10s. June 21st and 22nd, you'll get a special lunch from Duke and Devines. If you filled out a form, make sure not to bring a lunch. Here's sports news with Emily and Kyle. The Canadians are off to the Stanley Cup semifinals against the Las Vegas Golden Knights after sweeping the Winnipeg Jets. The Canadians are on a roll, having won their last seven games. The Canadians haven't trailed for the last 437 minutes of game play. Feels just like 1993 all over again, the last time we won the Cup. The Phoenix Suns have won three games against the newly crowned MVPs Nikola Jokic's Denver Nuggets. The Suns' Devin Booker has 28 points and Chris Paul has 27, leading them to the win 16-2. Hey VHS, I'm Chad and I'm Brad and, and together, together we're Chad and Brad. School's almost done, meaning exams are almost done. Before your exams, just remember to breathe because everything is chill. Sick tips, dude. Cycle one should almost be done everything except for math. Keep up the good work. Bro, that's rad. And my name's Brad. Anyway, cycle twos, you guys are so close to being done. Right. Sure to still study and make school a priority. But also, make sure to make time to focus on yourself. Like eat an awesome breakfast. Yeah, that's a great way to start the day, Chad. I know, I'm awesome. Summer break is right on the corner, so no need to stress about exams anymore. Anyway, that's all from us. Peace, Peace out. out! Thank you, guys. Now, it's time for the weather with Jerry, Avery, and Oliver the Crocodile Hunter. Good morning, mates. My name is Oliver the Crocodile Hunter. And I'm your man, Jerry, man. And I'm Avery, just Avery. I came all the way from the land down under just to tell you the weather for this week. So what's the weather like this week? So Avery, on Monday and Tuesday, it's gonna rain really hard, man. But. On Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, Montreal is going to get some of that Aussie sun. All right, man. Wait, what is an Aussie? Well, it's a person from Australia. That's right, mate. That's cool. Hey, Jerry. Yeah, man? Have you ever heard of Vegemite before? No, actually. What is it like, man? It's like this thick jam type thing that us Aussies love to put on toast. That's bussin' bussin'. Have you ever had Spam before? Never heard of it. It's like ham, but it comes in a metallic container. I had it every day for lunch in Hawaii. But now, I don't eat it anymore. That sounds awesome. Um, guys, is that all for this week? I think so, mate. Anyways, I gotta go. I got some crocodiles to catch. All right, man. Don't get bitten, dude. Anyways, back to you, Barka. Thank you, Avery. There is more information on the VHS website if you wish to read it. Well, that's all for today. Please note the Bison News is available on the VHS website, your home teacher on Google, on television in the main lobby, or right here on YouTube. And we will see you next week. Bye. Bye.